And the polls opened early this morning across Northwest Louisiana. On the ballot, a host of tax propositions and bond proposals, along with some runoff races in a few of our parishes. That included a three multi-million dollar bond proposal for the city of Shreveport and a runoff election for mayor of Natchitoches. Throughout the day, voters made their way to various voting precincts across Shreveport, including the locations at Betty Virginia Park and South Highlands Elementary. City, leader, city leaders hope to have a better turnout and better results for this bond election. The last time Shreveport had a bond election was in December of 2021, and the turnout then was only 13 percent, and four of the five proposals had failed. Some voters we spoke to today said everyone needs to come out and vote. The city of Shreveport needs us to vote. No matter how you vote, everybody should vote. And we want to keep in Shreveport in good shape. As you see, the park behind us at Betty Virginia Park is being redone, and we appreciate projects like this that the city is doing. And if you haven't voted, there's still plenty of time. Polling places across Northwest Louisiana are open until 8 p.m. tonight. If you've already in line at 8, you'll still be able to vote. Let's recap the three bond proposals for the city of Shreveport. The propositions include $125 million for streets and drainage projects, $82 million to fix water and sewer issues, and $49 million that would fund improvement to the police and fire departments and SPAR. As we mentioned earlier, in the city of Natchitoches, voters there have a couple of runoff races to decide on. The mayor's race pits current mayor, Democrat Ronnie Williams Jr. against former mayor, Independent Lee Posey. There's also a runoff race for the councilman at large seat between incumbent Betty Smith and Greg Burke.